I would have been happy to postpone your appointment until you were feeling better. Oh, no, no, I'm fine, really. I'm a little slower than usual, but I'll be off the crutches next week. I didn't want to miss the opportunity. Well, now, you have no hotel experience, Mrs. Prune? No, not as such. I have managed two big houses and taken care of some some very difficult people. Yes, I see. Do you have any knowledge of computers? I've worked on both um, IBM and Mac. Uh, I'm knowledgeable in WordPerfect, Clarisworks, Quicken, Lotus, Access, Excel. <sighs> like that. Things do slow down a bit in the winter, but uh, our hotel stays fairly much occupied most of the time. Mm -hmm. The National Numismatic Society is holding their 40th anniversary conference here at the end of the month. Oh. Over here is our formal dining room. This is where we hold smaller banquets, charity events, and smaller weddings. Oh. Yes, it's lovely. Mrs. Prue. Mrs. Roberts and I feel you wouldn't be right for the housekeeper job. Ah, oh, all right. Well, thank you anyway. But we would like you to consider becoming our new director of guest relations. Now, the position has some very specific requirements, all of which, Mrs. Prue, I'm convinced that you possess. Now, would you be interested in seeing if we can come to some agreement about, say, your salary? You got the job. You got the job. Ooh, you got the job. I got the job. I got the job. Yes. You got a fabulous <laughs> job. You're a responsible adult woman. <laughs> you did it. Mm. I guess I'm gonna have to get some clothes. Right now? No, not right now. Actually, I thought perhaps we're not finished celebrating. Oh. I thought we could. Have dinner, mm -hmm. and then go back to bed. Mm -hmm. And maybe you could stay with me all night. All right. Do you mean that? You want me to? Well, what do you want? Um, I want to not feel so new, no? scared. Me
Hi, this is Callie. Leave me a message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Callie? Hi, it's... It's Mom. I... I didn't call you at the office because I knew you wouldn't take my call. I, I just wanted to tell you I miss you. I wish we could talk sometime. I, lo I love you. It's 24 people. We're well, having the champagne with the plum pudding. And then might I suggest a nice port with the Stilton cheese? No, 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 you're still well within your budget. I do. I think it's going to be a wonderful party. All right. I'll talk to you then. Bye-bye. Excuse me, Mrs. Prue. There's a woman in the lobby waiting to speak with you. I hope it's not another complaint about the melting ice sculpture. How are you? 